Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. With me, Malera. <laughs> so, how do you spell picture? Picture? P I C T U R E. Got it? All right. Yeah. All right. Spell photo. Photo. P H O T O. Okay. Good. It's so weird. Like, do y'all not get spelling words anymore? I feel like y'all don't even bring home spelling words, no spelling tests. What's going on? I don't know. They haven't been giving us any spelling words lately. That's crazy. They haven't? No. Hmm. Okay, so with everything being said, guess what? I see you. You're here. That means you're tuned in with me, Magnificent Mondays with me, Malera. And guess what we're going to be doing? words vocabulary words with definitions and we're going to be learning how to spell regular words which is the basic words that we use in everyday life and you know maybe some advanced words down the line but let's start with the little basic ones that we have first now why am i doing this i'll tell you because i feel like there hasn't been any spelling words coming home from the kids a lot of kids are not specialized in spelling which is ridiculous and I understand that because we have been in a world where there has been some changes and that pandemic has definitely put a setback on a lot of things that we have been doing and things that has been going on which is weird and I understand it and I get it but guess what we're going to get up to par and we're going to learn new words for today tomorrow and in the future okay so with these words that we're going to learn they're not just for the kids so let me just say that doesn't just have to be for kids. It could be for kids, teenagers, adults, me, you. Guess what? I'm going to be learning here with y'all too when we get down the line to some words because there are the words out there that sound the same and they're spelled completely different. So we're all just going to be learning here together. So let's get into it with Magnificent Mondays with me, Malera. Let's start with our first 10 words. All right, so let's get into it. our very first episode, the startup of Magnificent Mondays with me, Malera. And today is January 16th, 2023, which means it is doo -doo -doo -doo, Martin Luther King Jr. Day. And like him, he had a dream and so do I. All right, so let's get into it. our very first episode, the startup of Magnificent Mondays with me, Malera. And today is January 16th. 2023, which means it is doo -doo -doo -doo, Martin Luther King Jr. Day. And like him, he had a dream, and so do I. So each week, we're going to have at least 10 words, and we're going to learn the word, how to pronounce it, the definition, and especially how to spell it. So here we go. No specific order or anything. And of course, down the line, if you have any words that you feel like you want anybody else to learn, you could just send them to the email at magnificent dot malera at yahoo.com so let me just show you how we're going to do this each week so for instance so do you remember in school like for instance if you have the word vocabulary you see how it's broken down like vo cab bu larry right so back then it'll show us how to do it and we'll be like vocabulary so let's count it with me vocabulary how many times will we clap our hands Five times. Yeah, five times. Vocabulary is broken down into five different sections to pronounce the word. Okay, so now that we have a little fill, instead of me clapping, I'm going to use a marker so y'all can see me break it down for you. All right? So, here we go. Okay, so the first word that we're going to have is friendly. Friendly. So that sounded like how many claps? Two. All right, so with that being said, this is how we're going to do it. We're going to put the line here, as in friend. And then Lee. And it's spelled F R I E N D L Y. Friendly. What does friendly mean? Kind and pleasant. Okay, so you got a little fill for it, so that's how we're gonna do our words. Next, our word is popular. Popular. So that was three claps, so that sounds like we need to break it down in three different ways. So pop, you, and then lar, P O P U L A R, which which means liked, admired, or enjoyed by many people or a group. Popular. Calculator. Calculator. 
How many different claps was that one? Four. All right, so we have cow, Q, lay, and tour. So, C-A-L-C-U-L-A-T-O-R, which is something used in mathematics, a small electronic device with a keyboard. We all use these in school. If not, I'm pretty sure you have used one at one point in time. They're on every device nowadays. So that's calculator. Understand. Understand. You see? Three claps, which is three different ways to break it down. So under, U-N-D-E-R, stand, S-T-A-N-D, which is an explanation or cause, as well as an intended meaning. Next word is general, general, which is three different separations, right? Gen, ner, and then roll, all right? And then that means considering or including the main feature or element affecting or concerning all or most people, places, or things. So that's what general means. Next word that we have is haunted. Haunted. That's two. Haunted. H-A-U-N-T-E-D. A place associated with ghosts. Ooh. That's haunted. Beginning. Beginning. So that's B E G I N N I N G, which is the point in time or space at which something starts. Okay. Next is conflict. Conflict. C O N F L I C T. A serious disagreement or argument. That is what conflict means. Next is definition. That's what we're doing here. We're finding the words and knowing the definition. So, definition. D-E-F-I-N-I-T-I-O-N, which is the exact meaning of a word. Definition. Adventure. As you can see down here, I kind of broke it down so you can see how it sounds. So, it's A D. V E N T U R E, which is an unusual and an exciting experience or activity. That's adventure for you. Okay, and last but not least, why do I have that word magnificent in Mondays with Mala? First of all, that word is just, it just sounds impressive. It just sounds like something that you need to tune into. So here we go magnificent. Magnificent, right? So that's M A G N I F I C E N T, which is impressively beautiful or extravagant. So, with that being said, thank you for tuning in with Magnificent Mondays with me, Malera, and I just gave you 10 new words that you're going to learn how to spell, and you know the different. <laughs> I'm sorry, and you know the definitions of. And then I'm thinking maybe at the end of the week, maybe we could take a test. And then for all you guys, tune in, follow, catch me next time on Magnificent Mondays with me, Malaya. So you just got some new words with Magnificent Monday, Malaya, which is me. And just use these words. I mean, start putting them in your vocabulary. If they're new to you, just, you know, add them into your daily life. Use them in different sentences. Parents at home, help your kids and, you know, just give them that push to let them know, like, we're all starting something new. Let's get these words together. That's going to prepare us, like I said, for today, tomorrow, and in the future. Because without vocabulary, how can we make anything make sense? Catch you next time. Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. Magnificent Monday. With me, Malera. Ha <laughs> ha.